Hey, you know the Buff basketball team is 1-3 in three since Mel Tucker bolted from Boulder? The Tucker hangover appears to be real as Buff Nation is in a bit of a funk. The hiring of a new head coach, Carl Durrell, did little to ignite the school's fan base. I'd say most are taking a wait-and-see approach. But after sitting down with Durrell, one thing seems obvious. If all goes well, the mild-mannered coach will be in Boulder a little bit longer than 15 months. It is my honor and pleasure to introduce new head coach of Michigan State football, Mel Tucker. There's no denying that Mel Tucker's sudden departure was a severe body blow to the Buffs, one that still lingers. But Rick George did his best to negate the damage by hiring a guy who, at least in one regard, is a 180 from his predecessor. His mindset probably about this job was different than where mine is. Mine is, is this is this is where I want to be for the long haul. Um, I believe this program can be successful year in and year out. And I have the peace of mind in knowing that, well, this, I don't have to look over my shoulder. Is there another place I want to be? I don't, I, no, there is no other place I want to be. There's a reason why we built the house here, is this is where I want to be. Darrell's first order of business was to talk to his new players. Now, there's no denying that Tucker left the young, talented roster behind. But for the new coach to have immediate success, the old coach's players need to buy in. They gave me a great feeling of how it ended and with, you know, they're working hard, you know, they want to win, you know, they want a voice. It's not like it's going to be a touchy-feely, nice, oh, that isn't that cute, that kind of situation. And it might be at times when they're, you know, obviously doing well. But in a way, it's, it's also correctable times, too. And there's going to be those tough talks, too. And I let them know that, you know, since they, they were excited about the transparency. While Carl Durrell still has work to do to win over Buff Nation, it certainly helps that the former Bill McCartney assistant coach hasn't forgotten a staple of this program. I'm just curious, have you had a chance to go through your wardrobe and get rid of all the red? <laughs> you know what, I never, ever since my time's working here, I never bought anything red. I'm, I'm dead serious. Just because he brainwashed me about you better not have anything red. I'm, I should have told that story, but I, I absolutely have nothing red in my closet. And it's really because of my experience here. Well, unfortunately, in Darrell's two previous stints as an assistant in Boulder, he never beat the men accord. He'll get a chance to rectify that when the two teams meet again in 2023.